this event gives you kind of the, uh, uh, you know, the, um, it's given me a foundation. I'm, I'm listening to people that have built generational wealth. Um, it it uh, is amazing at, at the things that you can accomplish if you put your mind to it. Uh, it's certainly, um, the timing in the market is, is really good right now with, with uh, you know, with the opportunities that are going to be out there available. We have people that are retiring every, uh, in record numbers right now in every sector. And so the ability to really do something, to pass it on to your kids and to make sure that, that uh, you know, that your family uh, prospers a after you uh, is, is just uh, tremendous. Right, so um, you know the quality of the people in the room is just uh, phenomenal. We've got everything from from doctors to uh, real estate folks that have you know got 50 million in a portfolio. Um, people of all walks of life, people that have been in business for several years, people that are buying businesses for the first time, people in in lots of different uh, sectors. Uh, a lot of things that uh, that you may be curious about. Your there's a good chance you're going to find somebody else that already has that knowledge in, in the room. So uh, just the ability to network with, with the quality of people that's here is, is, uh, is priceless. So uh, I, think, I think if, you know, if, if you're on the fence regarding coming to, uh, to one of these events, uh, it's definitely something that uh, this is my second event. So, um, you know, I was just excited about this time as I was the first time. Uh, I have no regrets at all. Uh, I've been able to apply uh, things that I had from the first event uh, to some of my endeavors since then, and then I've learned so much from this event that it's just, uh, the experience is just um, something that if you're looking to buy a business or, or merge or what have you, is something I think is uh, invaluable. I learned a lot from uh, Matt Walker and his uh, presentation regarding uh, hiring CEOs and, and hiring um, uh, management to come in and, and, and take over what has been an owner's role. So uh, the cool thing about the inner circle is, uh, you know, we, we have weekly meetings uh, that, that I attend as often as possible. Um, and the ability to be able to bounce things off of, of, of these folks and, and the rest of the room is just uh, tremendous. Uh, it certainly will save me and has saved me a lot of uh, effort and uh, possibly a lot of pitfalls that I otherwise may have went through. Uh, they're extremely available uh, at any time. Uh, it's just a, you know, and, and, and the ability to access them on a weekly basis is, is uh, very key. So if I could, uh, you know, my, my experience here is something that, that you know, is probably uh, there are things that that's going to affect you know the rest of the the rest of the way that I think about doing acquisitions and mergers and and just some of the information that I've learned about and the methods that people that uh, are very experienced in certain sectors and, and how they go about doing things is, is just a, uh, excellent uh, source and. and you know, I, I can't say enough of how this is probably going to affect a lot of the decisions that I make going forward. So, uh, something that I will begin uh, immediately doing following this event is, is um, you know, starting to look at, uh, at, at longer range goals, 10 year goals, uh, five year goals, and, uh, and three year goals, and, and starting to act on those goals immediately. Uh, not waiting, you know, another week to start implementing some of the th things and changes that I need to make to hit those goals, you know, 10 years from now. So um, a lot of information on, on you know, just uh, building myself up.